Hello Libra, welcome back to the channel. My name is Tisa and it's so great to have you here. So I am here and I'm looking into the next 24 to 48 hours. We're going to look into March the 1st, 2nd and the 3rd of 2024. Now everything that you need to know about me, it is all right down below and it is in our description box. Thank you for your love and your support right here. Okay, so this is Libra, let's see. Okay, thankful in the closet and we have right here new furniture. Okay. So there could be something happening in the closet. Could be the case. Right here at the bottom of your deck here, it says 5,000. So, okay, so, all right, let's see what else we get. I'm going to get all the cards down here that we'll talk about everything here. And let's see what we have here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. March the 1st through March the 3rd, 2024, please, for the sign of Libra. I started to make these videos shorts like I did before, but then I just said I'm going to just do it in a video. So I may still do a short, maybe I'll do shorts tomorrow. Okay. So we can have even more messages here. Okay. Libra. Okay. Let's see what else we got here, please, for Libra. This is March the 1st, 3rd, the 2nd and the 3rd, 2024. Libra. Okay. Libra, please. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Libra. Okay, Libra, this is the last set of cards I'm going to get here, and then we're going to talk about it, okay? So, Libra right here, this is March the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd, 2024, please, for Libra. Libra. Okay. So, I feel like you realize something here is meant to be whatever that could be. It could be a third party for some people right here. Alright? Or some faded meeting that you have going on right here. It says meant to be destiny return, pre predetermined encounter right here. So maybe you was fated to meet somebody right here. Alright? The Ten of Swords. Yeah. This could be insight about that. Or this is the end of a difficult time. Um, or this is your lover. Could be the case. This person you was fated to meet could be the person that here that is your lover for some people here. Uh, yeah, because I'm kind of feeling like that for some people here. Yeah, because it definitely could be a new love, okay? And whoever this person, maybe they're coming right here now, all right, um, at this particular moment in time, it's fated for you to meet them right now, okay? It says rest right here and consult an expert, and then we have yes right here. All right, so yes says right here that your intuition is correct right here. Take, a, take action accordingly. Okay, and it says rest. You've been working hard, take a nap and get some rest right here. So this could be right here. Your intuition is bringing you some message while you're asleep. Could be the case right here. Okay, it says consult an expert. More information is needed. Contact someone with expertise in this area here. Okay. Okay. Sorry about that. This one was on top here. So we have right here 5,000. All right, and they have right here that you look good in blue. Okay. So, I feel like for some of you right here, all right, 5000 could be anything. It could be $5,000. It could be 5000 anything. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I just kind of feel like right here, right? Let me see. You look good in blue. 5000 Okay. I feel like you was fated to meet somebody right here. Maybe something about blue has something to do with it. Now, blue can represent physical and emotional healing in some type of way. So maybe something is about healing in some way here that has something to do with something here. This faded meeting, maybe it is somebody right here that has to do with health or blue, could be the case. Um, the strength card right here and a spiritual awakening. Okay. So I feel like your inner strength is real strong or you're really, really powerful, I feel right here. Um, and courage, I kind of feel. Maybe somebody here do sing, I get the sense. The manifest, music for manifesting, maybe something here about music or some awakening that had to do with music could be significant in some way. You know, that's one way it could be. But um, this music for manifesting says to manifest rapidly. Think of your desire, why you chant, why you poem, and why you sing or even play music right here. Okay. So I feel like some of you right here, you having a spiritual awakening, you have an epiphany, you know, a, a rebirth or some big life lesson is happening right here. Okay, that definitely could be happening right here, surrounding a Leo or a Virgo or in Leo and Virgo season. Okay, this either could be a Leo or Virgo, okay, in the closet right here. So I feel like for some of you right here, somebody's manifesting something right here. Maybe it had to do with their 
their um their clothes. I don't know if it's their clothes right here or shoes or fashion. Could be significant stick away. Could be. Okay. So the Empress right here and the single. We have alone, isolated, lonely, and guarded right here. The Empress right here. Okay. So, okay. I feel like right here for some people right here, right? There's some treasure chest that's here. Somebody feel really thankful right here, okay? Or maybe you're thankful for something right here. It definitely could be some treasure that you're finding right here. It says an unforeseen windfall of new abundance that comes to you right here. I feel like something here is a treasure I'm getting right here, okay? Um, either to be single right here, okay? Or this is your mother. The Empress could be your mother. Could be a Taurus or Libra, Divine Feminine. Could be like Amazing Grace. In some way that you find something right here, I feel like while you're single, okay, or while you're alone or something like that right here, okay, or you're thankful that they're single, something like that right here, okay, I feel like some, some of you, something here is really good news I'm getting right here, it may be a third party right here, she in competition, mistress interference right here, and with the page of wands right here, I feel like something here is really good news, I also do feel like right here with these two right here, um, the page of wands could represent um, curious. Okay, maybe somebody here is really curious about you. Okay, I feel. All right. Um, and I feel like you could be a third party. I feel like somebody really likes something that you wear right here. This new furniture right here. Okay, it could be something that you wear that's in a closet or you have new clothes in the closet. Oh, new furniture. You know, maybe you have new furniture. You know, it could be the case. Or again, like contemplating time. I feel like you spend time alone meditating upon what you truly do desire. Okay, so this could be the fact that you're spending time alone meditating about something, or you're spending time alone and you're thinking about this third person right here, or they're thinking about you. Somebody has good news in a third person right here. I feel like you know, for some people here. There's something about furniture that definitely could be significant about it. Now, you know another thing I'm getting here? Some of you, you could find something in new furniture. Maybe some big treasure right here is either where you could find some um, furniture that's affordable or right here, like, you're finding, um, you're finding a treasure right here, okay? Inside of some furniture could be the case, too. Okay, now when I see this one right here and this one right here, I feel like with both of these right here, you're manifesting something right here. Okay, and that's coming through, I feel. Okay, it definitely could be new furniture or clothes or anything else. I feel like it's really good news. Okay, if you are getting new furniture with the page of wands right here, curiosity, hmm, perhaps there's something in it. Could be the case for some people here. Could be something in it for some people. Hmm. And you might find it while you're single somewhere or while you're alone somewhere. You could find it for some people here. And others of you, it's a third party here. I feel like you stumbled across a third party. Hmm. That's faded for some people right here. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like you're in love with them or something. Or they're financial security. Or this is you. Okay. So anyway, that's what I have here. Okay, thank you so much for taking a look. Don't forget if you like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe and even share it. Namaste to you. This is Libra.